some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Springfield, Massachusetts with uh, Marky Boy from Preston H. Now as he attempts to uh, interfere with the daily operations of the uh, Department of Health and Human Services located in that city, only to find himself trespassed and arrested. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. What's going on, everyone? This is Press NH Now over here today in Springfield, Massachusetts at the Department of Health and Human Services office for our First Amendment audit. Le who? The her. Now, that's not First Amendment auditing. It's more akin to harassment and disorderly conduct. And, of course, that's probably what you're going to be... Uh, kicked out of here for anyway disorderly conduct considering that you do get trespassed all right everyone so we're gonna take a look around inside take a tour possibly get some public records and uh see how they interact with me and the camera I'm here to get some public information. That's all. Okay. Oh, you're looking at the badge? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I'm not a police officer. Yeah, here is the uh, badge that he has on his person. Shiny badges don't grant extra rights. Well, I hate to say this, Marky boy, but uh, being a member of the press doesn't grant you any extra rights or privileges either, nor does uh, being a First Amendment auditor, considering that's just a made-up title anyway, nor does having a camera on your person uh, grant you any special rights or privileges. Nope, nope, nope. I know you frauditors like to think that, but it's not the truth. Okay. Yeah, no. Right. I... Public information? Yeah. From, from who in particular? No way in particular, just Department of Health. You have to come. You, you have to go back out to the desk. Why is that? Are there who offices? Are you, who are you with? Just, just me. No, you can't just roll through um, this office. Is this, a, is this a hallway? Like a public hallway? No, it is an inside of the Department of Health and Human Services. Okay. This is our building. It's not your building. It's the people's building. Okay. The pe and that's another thing, too. Uh... Frauditors tend to have this belief that anybody who is working for the government is not a member of the public. Hell, I've encountered some frauditors who think that uh, government workers are subhuman and uh, have no rights to begin with, which that's just a way of, uh, well, justifying their actions towards any government worker they encounter. But Marky Boy, uh, the truth is, that this government worker is also a member of the public, and this is a member of the public that does have say over this building. So you can take your skunk ape looking ass out that door before you get trespassed and arrested. Oh, wait, that's not gonna happen. You're gonna get trespassed and arrested anyway. So have fun, skunk ape. People's building. So did we, let me say we have a process for visitors. They stop at the front desk, uh -huh. they sign in, okay. they get a badge, they say who they are here to see, and that is our public building process yeah, that we use. I don't want to go by that policy. Well, then you have to go back out. No, not at all. I'm here to get some public information and so ask some what questions. I'd like to do is Maybe I'll, name, first of all. Like, my name Helen Carlson Harris, Commissioner of okay. Health and Human Services nice. for the City of Springfield. Do you have a business card? I do. Can I have but, one? Maybe you get a chance. First, I'll meet you over there. Well, now, uh, Marky Boy, uh, you have essentially run into the person in charge of this particular building. So, uh, no wonder you get uh, trespassed and arrested so quickly out of here. I mean, come on now. First impressions are everything, Marky Boy. you got to impress the people in charge of the building in order for you not to be kicked out. So, yeah, pitiful, man. Real pitiful. Insulting the uh, person in charge of the building. First thing when you meet them. Good job, dude. You're a complete moron. What's your name? 
Ann Kissel, Deputy Commissioner for Health and Human Services. Okay. So you, this is the desk that you stop at right here. Okay. And uh, this is Ashley. Be happy hey, Ashley. to give you um, any information that you need as far as this building is concerned. Just happy to do that for you. Yeah. But individuals can't just walk out. Did you bus him in? Yes. Okay. And so individuals can't just walk off the street and walk through our. Of course they can. If they have business here, they can. Yeah. And what business do you have here, sir? I've already told you. Uh, could you repeat it, please? Yeah, to get some public information. What public information can I, we I don't know yet. Do what now? You don't know what kind of public information you're going to get from the Department of Health and Human Services? Yeah, dude, this just uh, shows that you came in here looking for trouble to start with because most people coming into a building like this already have an idea of the kind of information that they're looking to FOIA. I mean, I hate to compare frauditors, especially these two, but take an example from uh, Goat Boy. I mean, he always has a general idea of what he wants to FOIA the moment he enters a uh, building. Though that still does not excuse uh, his uh, pitiful uh, actions when he gets in the building, but at least he has a bit more preparation than you do, you freaking moron. You seem to be a bit more unorganized. I don't I haven't looked around. I... That is, so you want public information, but you're not sure of what public information yeah, you want. It depends on. And you want to roam the halls of this The public publicly building. accessible areas, yes, correct. Uh, Without telling us I don't your need purpose. I just did tell you my purpose three times now. To get public information. Yes. And so this is To take pictures, to take video, to get some public information. Would yeah. Do me a favor, call the Springfield Police Department. Okay, so I can't get public information? And of course, uh, part of her job uh, as being a commissioner is to keep the troublemakers out. And she heads off to call the police, which is quite understandable when you have some gibbering uh, meathead of a frauditor like this who thinks that he can boss around the uh, person in charge of the building. Uh, no, that's not exactly going to work out in your favor, you gibbering idiot. Please don't go any further, please. I'm not going I'll in her office. That. That's her private office. I got that. I know the rules. But you're filming her, her private office. I'm not in her office. Sir, it's... Can I, I just need a business card. That's all. Does she give her permission to be over there? No. To be here? I don't need your permission. I didn't say here. I said in her office. I'm not in her office. Let's get that straight. No, door. I'm not in her office. What's going on? Don't spread lies. I asked her to close the door. That's not a lie. No, you said that I was in her office. She's calling. Who is he? Where is he from? I just need a business card from her, if possible. Business cards. Oh, there you go. Thank you. I appreciate it. You're welcome. Yeah. You're the uh, commissioner, you said? That's right. Okay. Do you have a business card since you're the... You're yeah, under, yeah, she's under you, right? Everyone in this department is. Okay, cool. Excuse me. Hello. Yes. Do you have a business card? Actually, you can no, go mine is downstairs, though. Okay. Do you want me to meet you down there, or you want to come back up, or no. you don't want to get me a business card? Mm -hmm. You can follow the commissioner. You can reach anyone up in my staff uh, through me, and you have through my you. business card. Okay. Okay? Yeah, cool. I mean, so exactly, like, what do you guys do here? Like, people come in here to make appointments, or... This is the Springfield Department of Health and Human Services. Okay. We are the Board of Health for the Commonwealth of Massachusetts okay. for the City of Springfield. There are various operations that go on yeah. here. We do serve the public. Okay. We have nursing services here for our residents. We also have environmental health services here, inspecting other restaurants and doing other public yes. health work. So okay. our, our work is very broad. Yeah. Um, our work is intentional. Our work is uh, very specific to yeah. the residents of the city of Springfield. Okay. All right. Well, I appreciate it. I mean, that's pretty much a lot of the information I kind of need to know. And you know what, uh, my uh, idiotic friend? Uh, that's pretty much the same information you could have gotten off their 
website. What a novel idea, going on to a website, even if you have to go to a library to get on the internet to find this information, where rather than uh, going and disturbing the work of everybody in that building just so you can have some clicks and views on your pitiful little YouTube channel. End up getting trespassed and getting another arrest on your record. Wow! So you did all this for information that you could have found easily enough online. Wow! Certainly. Um, is the PD on the way? Because I don't want to run away from them. I mean... I, 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 I'll speak with them. I, I have no problem with I that. I told them that I would give you an opportunity to leave. Um, you haven't asked me to leave. Please leave. I, I think I'll wait for them. Okay. I'll yeah. tell them. Yeah, because this is a public office and I am here to get public information. So, let them. Well, dude, not exactly. Uh, if there's a lot of confidential information around that they don't want you to see because of the sensitive nature of it, then, uh, well... Uh, photography and uh, video recording is not uh, authorized on that premises. That being said, they can also trespass you. But I know you don't believe in trespassing laws, but just because you don't believe in the law doesn't mean you aren't affected by it. So now that she's officially said that you can't be there, you are now trespassing. And if you don't leave, the police will force you off the premises and or arrest you. And in this case, you are going to get arrested because of your belligerent dumbass attitude. Let's see what they say. Yeah, isn't that what a uh, lot of dumbasses say who have massive criminal backgrounds anyway have to say about law enforcement in their area? They're corrupt. They wouldn't let me get away with my crimes. Stuff like that. Yeah, Mark. I, we all know about your massive criminal history. We all know that you're one of those idiots who get in trouble a lot. So yeah, it's only understandable that you think that it's the police that are the ones that are corrupt when, well, it's been actually you the whole damn time. Go figure. Um, she's, she's here. Can you not film in her private office, though? I can record it now. I'm not in there. That's how that works. There you go. Like, create your privacy. And who are you? Who are you? What? Do you work here? Yeah, I work. Okay, here. just curious. You don't need to go in there either. It says employees only. Okay, yeah. so you don't need to go in there. I'm not going in there. Cut it out. I know I know where I'm supposed to go and where I'm not supposed to go. Stop. Cut it out. Please stay in the public area. Yeah, well thank you. Oh, I will stay in the public area. I will stay in the public area. Thank you. Yeah, so I don't know why the police are being called if I'm in a public area. Because you were asked to leave. Yeah, you can't tell me to leave just because I'm recording in here and because getting public the information. Asked you I don't leave. care what she said. And you are You're going to learn today. You really are. Watch. Oh, Marky boy, this prediction is just going to age so well before the end of this video. Yeah, it's almost as if that uh, you don't have foresight. You're going to understand. I've been nothing but polite in here. I've been nothing but respectful. I told you what I was here for. Mm -hmm. And I'm in the public areas. So make sure you tell that to the PD when they come, okay? Well, you were asked to leave. You can't leaving. ask me to leave. I haven't committed any crime. Well, we did ask you. you know, Marky boy, it's funny how it doesn't say anything about having to commit a crime before trespassing occurs. Because you know what? Trespassing is more of a preventive measure because, you know, you do get these occasional jackasses who will commit a crime if you don't take uh, that proactive action of trespassing to get them off the property because, you know, 
things do happen, and crimes will be committed if they don't get trespassed. These preventative actions are easy to understand for the average person, but unfortunately you frauditors have below average intelligence, so I guess it just flies right over your head. For what purpose? Enlighten me. It, what, for, not, why are you asking me to leave? Because I'm recording? No, I never said that. I didn't bring up anything about the recording. So why are you asking me to leave? Because I'm here to get public information? Cause because those are the two things that I'm doing. Because the commissioner asked you to leave. Okay. And you don't know why she asked me to leave? It's at her discretion. Yeah, okay. No, it's I'm not. Employee. It's I'm really not, employee. though. You're my employee. Remember that. You know, if I were in her position and... Some idiot said that I was his employee. Be, I'd be like, well, show me your name on my paychecks, Mr. Boss Man. If you can't show it to me, then you're not exactly my boss. And you're just merely a pretender wanting to act like a big man around here. Am I right? So basically an, a mouse trying to act like a freaking lion. I know. Wow. When you cash those checks, remember, it's the taxpayer's money. So can I just ask you why you're asking me to leave? Is it because I'm recording? I'd rather get a better understanding on why. Maybe I can make a determination. Can you give me your name or no? No. Okay. I don't think I have to do that. Okay. Um, does it involve like a... Can I ask you again why you're asking me to leave? And maybe I can determine on if it's suitable? No? Okay. That's what I thought. So where are the public accessible areas? Because I don't see any signs or anything like that. This waiting room? This is all public? Okay. That's it? Unless so, you have an appointment here. Okay. So what? what's down there? Are there like, are the public offices down there? Is it just... It's offices. Okay. It's offices. Uh, where are there employees here? Available? Yeah. yeah. Who work here? Okay. Work. Yeah, this may be a public area, but they caught you loitering around in the... Uh, non-public areas in the back, you freaking douchebag. So don't spin it in that particular way. I mean, the camera doesn't exactly lie, you know. Okay. They probably have better things to do. You can't trespass somebody in a public building just because you want to. You know that, right? They have to be committing a crime in order to do so. You do understand, Commissioner, that you can't you can't demand somebody to leave a public office, right? Unless they've committed a crime. I haven't committed any crimes. I'm not here to commit any crimes. A lot of standing around. That's what you guys do all day? One, two, three, four, five. I wonder how much money that is. And What are they like, your security team? <laughs> Is all over a camera? What are you guys doing in here if you're so afraid of a camera? No one's afraid, sir. Oh, so why? I'm just we curious not, on why. You will not engage this job. Oh, you should have done that the first, first time. 
Just ask you what you guys did in this office and getting some public information. This is a big deal. Oh, so if you seek information from the government, then you will be arrested. My, 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 uh, Marky boy, how how revolting that is. Uh, too bad it's not the truth. I know me personally, I saw information from the government uh, innumerable times for, well, various reasons, and not once was I ever arrested for it. But then again, I didn't go trying to impose my will on anybody else in that office or act like a complete douche canoe like you do. So uh, what we have here is a bit more spin from somebody who, well, doesn't really have an honest bone in his body. Did you get a business card? No. Everybody's quiet now, huh? How you doing? What's going on? Will I have a seat? No. Okay. Do I have to? Police have been called? Yeah, I'm just waiting on them. Yeah, me too. Yeah, me too. Me three. Me four, five, six, seven. Do you have that sign-in sheet? Do you don't want me to sign in? I thought it was like procedure. You already passed the entrance where people sign in and kind where of Where is that? Here. Well, I'm, I'm asking like... Okay. Right. Now, okay, don't engage. Okay. I thought the reception was here to sign in. Is that not the case? Well, gee, dude, why would they let you sign in at a point in time where you have now been trespassed from the building and are expected to leave, but end up refusing to do so? I mean, what sense does that make, you dumbass? Interesting. Can I see your ID tag? Isn't it illegal to record in Massachusetts without consent of both parties? No. I'm pretty sure there's this Massachusetts. Okay. Generation. Yeah, while you're tapping, eavesdropping, yeah, good luck with that. Good luck. Yeah, yeah, good luck. We have cameras in here. I didn't give you guys permission, but you're recording me. How ironic. YouTube trend. Nobody's caused nobody's caused the scene except for them. Yes, sir. How you doing? Good, how are you? Alright. All right. YouTube thing, huh? Alright, so you gotta go. Why is that? Because this is not a public building. What do you mean? Is this you the, see how the door locks and you get buzzed in? I had no idea. No. Okay, it's not a public oh, building. He just told you that. They offer public services. Yeah, that's what I'm here for. I need, okay. I need to get some more well, public now services. Now they don't want to give you service. so you, They, they can't refuse leave. services. They can. They can. Well, they can can I ask you why? They can and they did. Can I ask you why? You have to figure that out with them. Can you call a sergeant for me? No. All right, let's go outside. Can you call a sergeant? We're going to go outside, outside Don't touch Step me. outside, you're going to jail. Don't we're going to go outside. outside. Can I ask you for what? Because we're asking you to leave. Now you're trespassing. Are you asking me? Are you... Give me a lawful order. I'm a lawful order. What would be the crime? Huh? What would be the crime? Trespassing. How so? Go watch Dude, Can you not fucking touch me? Get out of the building! Don't touch me. Okay. You wanna fucking touch me, you piece of I shit? did! Go. you. Go. you. What's your name and badge number? Right there, you can read it, right? Get off me, dude. I'm gonna Get off back. the property! No. I can stay right here. No. It's a public sidewalk. It's a public sidewalk.
a public sidewalk. I'm outside of the building. Yeah, I'm outside of the building. I'm outside of the building, sir. You told me to leave, I left. You I was going on the property. property. I'm trying to go on. I could be on this property. Can you call the lieutenant, please? No. Yep. You'll see him inside. Well, it appears you got the right cops on the right day. These guys weren't going to mess around with any First Amendment auditor. Bravo, guys. Bravo. They didn't give you much time to do anything other than leave, and you even refused to do that. So, uh, Marky boy, yeah, uh, you earned this one. Congratulations. You are one of the biggest morons on the internet. So, at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one. You don't want to go to jail. For what? You read this. Yeah. I don't have to listen to read anything. It. Blah, 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 blah. I'm not listening. Gosh. I'm not. No. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. You suck. They think they know it all. What's the Third Amendment, punk? Tell me the Third Amendment and I'll leave. What's the Third Amendment? What's the Third Amendment and I'll fucking leave right now? What's the Third Amendment? Tell me. Third Most definitely. Because you don't understand why I'm here with a camera doesn't mean I have to get out of here. Doesn't mean I have to leave. Doesn't mean I have to go. <clears throat> that sort of thing. Well, this is what we're going to do. Um, we're going to have to enforce the, the CT and have you leave the property. Um, per the postmaster, per the lead. Uh, per the um, the uh, the person, the landlord of this uh, facility. Uh, so with that said, um, oh, I've got too many entities. I know. You gave me a warning to get off the property. I got off the property. I need your name, date of birth. No, sir. You're either going to be proud or you're going to jail. I'm going to remain silent, sir. Okay. Do you want my name and date of birth? Put your hands right now. He chose poorly. Morning, Deputy Regan St. John's County Sheriff's Office. Two reasons I'm stopping you. One, Pine Island speed limit's 25. You're going 36. Okay. That's still 10 miles per hour over the posted speed limit. It's 25. No, it's not 25? So, I was going at 35. So, that's 10 over. You just told me that you're going 10 over the posted speed limit. It, yes, you did. You said you're going 35, right? Yeah, That's a 25. 35. No, ma'am. It's it. The whole thing's 25. Okay. The other issue is your license plate cover is illegal. You can't have a tinted license plate cover over your license plate. Hello, ma'am. Hi. How are you? Okay. I'm doing good. Well, you're detained right now. You're not free to leave. Okay. Why? You. you know you are not to be on campus. You no. Put the phone down. She yes. asked me to leave and I left. No, ma'am. So you, you guys. You are now under arrest. You guys are arresting me for nothing. No. You know you've been arrested for this before. Dumbass. You dumbass. You're a dumbass. Such a dumbass. You're an ass. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's... Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that? You know why you're kicking me out? Because you don't want what, someone watching a movie in the courthouse. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, I know some of y'all are disappointed. I'm disappointed. Um, I hope that you will continue to watch this channel because this channel has brought more good than negativity.